After retrieving my lost drone, I set off for Kintamani to spend the night there. It wasn't long before the sky started pouring. The oncoming traffic was barely visible until they come up close. On our way to Kintamani, we made a stop over at Bantam. Regan said the place belongs to his nephew and it has a view that is worth a million dollars. The wood sawmill belongs to his nephew. Hello, friend. Hello. 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 Very nephew down there, and uh, we can see the the sea overseas there. Wow. But now, <laughs> well, I, I can't a... talk a lot about that. <laughs> this one? Yeah. Is a beautiful dream. A beautiful dream. <laughs> Wait, Upi, Upi! In the future, if uh, not good prospect anymore for the wooden business, I ask him to uh, uh, open guest house in here. Because sunrise can get here. Oh, sunrise. Right. Okay. Can. Can, 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 can. A bit slippery. Better be careful. Oh, right. There is maracuya plant. What plant? Maracuya. Maracuya. Yeah. Many people uh, for drink, yeah, uh, use it to, to make it juice. Just juice. Stay, uh? Yeah. Just, just, just stay here. <laughs> It's pretty amazing to see how the building was sitting on a steep slope like this, using stilts. Who's there? Ding ya? Ya? Wait, jalan jalan doang, usir. Including enjoying the coffee, you can play drone as well. <laughs> Very nice view. Oh, this is beautiful. Yeah, yeah. like I said before. So. My so goodness. Uh, see already. Oh, and then it's far away there. Uh huh. Yeah. From the mountain, not Bali. Wait, wait. Yeah. Apa gonna camp on the bulan ini? Okay. As my eyes could see, the vegetation on the mountains were planted, they unwild. The top layer is a kind of plant they planted to provide shade for the coffee plants below. And on some parts of the plot, passion fruit was planted to provide different streams of income. So Regan's nephew has a wood sawmill, a plantation, a drink stall, and is currently building a bed and breakfast guest house. Very enterprising, isn't it? It's also interesting to see how the road runs on the ridge line and how people live up in the mountains. Unfortunately, the clouds were rolling in and I hesitated to make moves that are too adventurous because I don't know the terrain well and it's too early to lose any drone. I wondered if bad people exist in Bali, so I asked Regan about it. He shared that 
One of the landowners who owns a plot planting coffee doesn't live in the area. So when it was time to harvest the ripening fruits, he came back only to realize that all the ripened fruits have been harvested. For a Singaporean who lives in an urban environment, it's a little bit difficult to imagine this kind of stealing. Fruit by fruit, pluck. changing the battery and have another go at it. But much to my surprise, the whole place was cloaked in clouds again. 